had some rain of her own over the past few weeks, and that's got some green country farmers smiling ear to ear. Many growers are welcoming all the moisture, but they're cautious to say the drought is over. Two News reporter Patricia Santos is in our studio with the latest. Well, Dina, all this rain is a welcome sight for farmers, and I want to show you what the situation looks like here. This is the latest U.S. drought monitor map, and you can see the areas in white here clear of the drought. The yellow, uh, area in yellow and beige here still experiencing some moderate drought. <laughs> Now we got a chance to see it for ourselves. This is video out in the Heldermon Farm in Rogers County. And you can see the ponds are full, the grass is green and very tall. Uh, Ray Helderman has a few complaints about all this rain, like rising waters at Uliga Lake. And he says that the ground is too wet to cut hay. But for the most part, he is happy about this rain. He has about 250 head of cattle. And he says keeping them fed during last year's drought was costly. Things are looking better for the summer for the start of summer so far. It's definitely better and we appreciate it. Uh, uh, a lot of producers have had to cut back on numbers and I, I'm one of them. Uh, we had cull heavier last year than we normally would and uh, had to buy more hay. Usually I produce enough hay that I don't have to buy hay but I had to get out and hustle hay and uh, hopefully we won't have to do that this year. Helderman is enjoying and, and storing all he can. Now, experts warn we are still in a drought cycle, and this year might just be a wet year, so uh, farmers are being told to prepare for dry years ahead. Patricia Santos, 2 News, works for you.